Hello muffins, it has been so long since I did an updated video on my weight loss channel. Thank you for joining me for this video. This video hopefully is going to be really quick. I just got in um, from doing my damn taxes. I was supposed to have been did them, but I just did them today. So I ain't getting back much. But anything is less than anything, okay? Alright, so I want to just do an updated video. I don't remember the last time I did a video, like the date or anything. I'm, I'm not quite sure. So let's start with the stats. Um, I had surgery um, December of December 31st of 2015. I think so, yeah, 15. My start weight was 262 pounds. My lowest weight was 133 pounds. My maintenance weight is between 140 and 150. I am currently 160 pounds. So three years into my surgery, I gained from my um, maintained weight about 20 pounds that I really am looking to get off, like 20, 25 pounds. Um, I know what it's from. It's from, I like it. I love my my little Bacardi and Smirnoff and stuff. I eat more um, fast food than I was eating before. Not too much, but I am, and I know it. So I know what it's from. The only good thing about this is that I know that during the summertime, because I walk a lot, it's going to drop off. And um, I have a coworker at work that we walk like home, not actually home like we walk from 168th street to 145th street so we do that every night and that's really good for us you know and um, we started doing it at one time and then we slacked off but i noticed that the more that i walk the more that i lose so i'm just looking to lose like one um like 25 maybe 20 to 25 pounds and then i'm okay with it um it's kind of worrying me a little bit only because I never want to get back up to like 200 pounds. And it is really, really easy to do that. It's especially when you're not really paying attention to what you're doing and the weight gain. So that's what I'm working on now. Um, just really losing this extra weight that I've gained. Which it really doesn't look bad on me. Honestly, it doesn't. It looks really, really nice on me. Like really, really nice. I look thick in all the right places. But... Um, I could stand to come down a little bit because I can feel that extra 20 to 25 pounds on me. Like, I can feel it on my body. So, I know that it's time for me to, like, really focus to get this weight off. Um, and, oh, yeah. And I had um, my arm and wide surgery in the Bronx at the main um, Montefiore Building um, Hospital on Bainbridge. Um, it's been such a long time, Muffins. So between that time I have, um, I told you Muffins that I was having a really hard time with my, um, my iron. If you see any food around me, I'm sorry, like around my lips or something, I was eating, um, peanuts. Um, so I was having a really hard time with my vitamins and I was so iron deficient that, um, they gave me an iron d diffusion infusion i'm sorry and like ever since i had the iron infusion muffins you know that i used to go through like four to five bags of ice a day and that's what caused me to like really break my teeth like my teeth started like breaking off because i was eating so much ice you know so i have not had any ice since i had the iron infusion at all like but um, I have another appointment in April for them to take more blood work, and I'm going to have an iron infusion again. Um, my main problem now is my vitamin, I think she said my vitamin K or something like that. And I'm still having a lot of stomach problems. Um, they did give me medication. It's really not doing much. Well, it, let me not say that. It is doing a lot that I don't have that severe pain that I used to have, but... I still have a lot of gas, a lot of like gassiness in my stomach to where you can actually hear it sometimes and it's so freaking embarrassing and annoying because you can hear my stomach like grumbling. I have like really, 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 really bad gas. So um, that's the only like thing that gets on my nerves with it right about now. But other than that, I'm, I'm, I'm really cool. Like um, I've been working a lot and I can like I've been working a lot like I've been really 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 exhausted so that's why I haven't really done too many videos because it's like as soon as I get home I'm just like straight in the bed 
And it just feels like once I get to sleep, it's time to wake up again, you know? So, um, I'm having problems sleeping. I'm thinking about as, asking, asking, asking is not a word, is it? Whatever. Thinking about speaking to the doctor to get me some sleeping pills for the nighttime because I take over-the-counter sleeping pills, but I have to take so many of them for me to go to sleep, and I know it's not good for my liver, but it's the only way that I can get to sleep. Like, I'm having such a hard time. I'm like, it's like my body is so exhausted that I'm having a really hard time sleeping at night. So that's another thing. Um, it's been almost three years out, three or four years out from my surgery. I'm getting back to normal. Everything is kind of getting back to normal. I still sometimes have a restriction. I can eat a lot more muffins, but I still have that restriction, which I really am grateful for. Um, and the last time I went to the doctor, the doctor was talking to me about the things that I eat. Like, I didn't know, like, um, if after the RNY surgery, like, it's really hard for you to digest um, uncooked greens. And I love spinach. I love broccoli. I love salads and stuff like that. But then I noticed after I would eat them, I would have, like, severe dumping. But that was because, like, my body can't digest them correctly. I have been dealing with a lot of dumping recently. Um, and I know that I need to change the way somewhat of the way that I'm eating. I also, I'm trying to incorporate just plain water back into my diet. Like if I'm at work and like if I'm um, working on the floor or something, I try to make sure that I have like a pitcher of water that I can drink throughout the day because I know that my body is really, really, really dehydrated and I can see the difference in my skin. Like, before, I wasn't breaking out at all. Now, I'm starting to get, like, little pimples and stuff to where I did. I never had a problem with, like, my um, skin or anything. So, you know, I'm just going to have to incorporate water. Um, my hair is growing really, really nicely. I love my hair muffins. Because, you know, like, one of the side effects of having this surgery is, like, you lose a lot of hair. And I've had thinning in the front of my head and there is a video a dramatic video that i do have on this page with how much hair loss that i had um during this weight loss journey like a lot a lot a lot of hair loss so you can go back and look into that video um and also i met two people i met one young lady that was on the bus that she really recognized me. she was like hey that's that that fat chick so I met her, I want to say hi to her, that I had a patient in the hospital, and she's like, I've seen you before. I'm like, oh my God, like she's seen me before. Um, so she was like, did she see me before um, on my weight loss channel? Um, I don't remember her name, but I wouldn't like even say her name because she was at, at my job, and I don't, like I work at a hospital, I wouldn't dare put her name out there like to show that she was um, in the hospital. But hey girl, how you doing? And then I met like a lot of people. I met a couple of dude um, guys. One of my coworkers, like he had weight loss surgery. I'm not gonna mention his name, but he does watch my videos and he looks fantastic. And I'm so glad that I met someone, especially a guy that had the weight loss surgery, that we can vibe together about things because we both understand each other. If you haven't went through this surgery, you're not gonna un understand the struggle. And people today still have in mind that we took the easy way out by having weight loss surgery no bitch we have not this shit is not freaking easy okay this is not an easy way out this is just a tool honey because you can gain the weight back don't get it twisted okay so like it just makes me mad when i hear people say that um you took the easy way out or why you didn't do it on your own bitch have a fucking seat in the back row okay ho have a motherfucking seat nobody asked you for your opinion but i don't rest um, so other than that, muffins, there's not really much going on. That's why I have not done an updated video because honestly, muffins, I'm about three to four years out and it's really not much I've changed. The only big dramatic change is that I've gained about 20, 20 pounds that I'm trying to get off. I've been walking like with my coworker and he's going to be leaving me. But congratulations on his new job position. But I know for the summertime, I'm going to have to just do a lot more walking. I think instead of like jumping on the bus i will actually walk further to like catch the bus on like probably across the bridge or something just so i can just like get this weight off um you know it's starting to bother me only because i'm like i don't want to get back up to 200 pounds but 
My body looks good though, honey. It looks good. Um, of course I get like a lot of attention. Oh my god, let's just give a silent moment of the attention that I get. And it's not really even good intention. Int attention. It's just like bitch. You tried it with that line, right? Like that line is like you know, I, you know, and it gets annoying, and then I don't want to seem like I'm, like, conceited or something. But, bitch, you can't come up with nothing more creative when you approach a female. But, um, whatever. It just, it is what it is. Um, I am just really looking for the old timers in this community to to actually do an updated video and I'm gonna call out some people. Come on, sweet for life. I need to see an updated video, honey, because you look fabulous, fabulous, honey. Um this is a lot of people older um you know veterans in this community that you know I can understand you you know, not doing videos anymore because I understand that, like, you, you just get back to your life to where weight loss channel and weight loss journey is not your life anymore. You're not eating, breathing, and shitting it anymore. So I can understand that part, but I would love to see an updated video. I really, really would because you're, like, further out than I am. And I'm sure you have a lot of wisdom and a lot of advice for people that are still young in the journey because I am. I've only been in this journey for about three years the end of the year before so i'm so young with this and i'm still you know learning and stuff like that i would like to see the veterans come back out and tiffany where are you at tiff where are you at like you just dropped off the face of the earth with your dog on channel like what the fuck you know so much as you know that when i before i end my channel um my my video i'm sorry I always do an updated video. Muffins, if you have any questions, comments, concern, please leave them below. Y'all muffins know that I, I answer like everyone because I don't have that many subscribers on my page. So I can answer y'all muffins. I can answer y'all. So I just got in from um, doing my taxes, stopping at my daughter's job, um, bringing her lunch, and then I came home. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to chill. Like, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, I'm off, honey. I'm about to chill. My room is always going to be a mess, and I ain't going to freaking worry about it because I am not in the mood. Like, I am seriously fatigued, okay, when I get home from work. Like, I really am thinking of going part-time because this job is really killing my body. Like, I'm 42 years old. I know that it doesn't look like I'm 42 years old, but, bruh, my body feels like it's 80, okay? Um, well, I, I think that's what I'm going to wind up doing once I sign up for school because I'm going to go back to school to get my associate's degree because I only have my GED and I need to get my associate's degree. But I suck in math, so I have to take a math class from $11.99. Um, I'm not going to go, like, part-time now. Once I probably start college, I'm going to drop down to part-time because I don't think I could do full-time in college at the same time. My brain ain't set up that way, honey. It, it's just not set up that way. Mm -mm. But I got to do what's best for me. Okay, honey? All right, so let's do this body shot. If you see anything in the background, please ignore it because... I'm not cleaning up my room, honey. I'm, I don't have the energy. I really don't care. You're not living with me. I have nobody laying up in my bed. It's just me and my children. So I really don't care less about the way my fucking room looks. I really don't care. I don't care. Okay. So let me step back, muffins. And um, I started out wearing a size... Um, 3X to 4X muffins. I was the biggest size I think I was was a size 18, 22. I, my lowest size was like a size 2, 2, 4, 2, 4. But now I'm like a size 5, 6, 4, 5, 5, 6, depending on the style that I have. But you see the skirt here, honey? I got this skirt from the Salvation Army, honey. This is the first time, you know what, and this is an NSV for me. I have not worn a skirt, like a skirt, not a dress, because I wore a dress like to a funeral before. And I want to tell you, Muffins, thank you for giving me all your well wishes um, when my auntie passed away. She's like my favorite, favorite aunt. She did pass away. So thank you for all of the support and stuff. So, but I have not worn a skirt since I was probably like 
12, 11. And I really don't wear a lot of skirts, but this is one of the skirts that I got from the Salvation Army. And this is a size small. And this is a jacket. This jacket, y'all have seen it before, muffins. But let me take off what I have on so you can get a body shot. I'm, I'm warning you. Don't, don't pay no mind to the background. And if anybody say something about my background, I'm going to come at your ass, okay? Because y'all know my mouth is like fire, honey. My mouth is like fire, honey. I'll come at you, okay? So, so this jacket, I wear it like every freaking day at my job. And this is a size small. I know it might look like my daughter's jacket. But no, it's mine, ho. It's mine. So this is a size small skirt. And the top, I wear extra small in tops because I have no boobies. So, and I still am kind of self-conscious about my arms. So, I do wear a lot of long sleeve. Even though it's not as bad as it was before. Like, my arms are nowhere as bad as I thought they should be with losing weight so fast. So, let me hurry up into a body shot so I can cut this video off and eat my food. Because I went to the home time. I went to the buffet. I love their um, string beans. So I'm going to eat that. So this is what I look like. This top is a small. And you can see, like, you can see I've gained a lot of weight in my stomach. And this is my problem area. But I'm going to get it together, muffins, because the summertime is coming. I'm, Mama's going to be walking, honey. Mama's going to be walking. I'm going to lose this motherfucker extra 25 pounds, honey. I'm going to guarantee you on that. So this is what the back looks like. You see that, muffin? The little bit of weight. It's in my booty. It's in my booty. Is in my booty. I got a little bit of booty now. It's actually a little bit too much for me. Like, I want it to be smaller. I'm, I'm so used to having, like, no booty. And this is just, like, a little bit too much. I still got my thighs back. Um, Y'all know I ain't got no boobies, honey. These are... If I took this bra off, my titties would probably be down here, honey. But whatever. It's not even a bra. It's just a sports bra. But this is the body shot. This is what I look like, muffins. And I went to my daughter's job, but I showed her I had her boots on. She kicked me out her job. She was like, get out my job. Get out. Because, like, I'm always, like, um, like, taking her shit. I'm always taking her shit. But that is it, Muffins. So, I just really wanted to come back to do an updated video, Muffins. It's been a while. And I know, like, I look forward to people doing updated videos just to keep you inspired or whatever. And if you have any concerns comments or anything else please leave them below and if you have a um weight loss channel please leave your information below so i would love to subscribe to your channel muffins and just see this is what i hate about gaining weight like you see this shit right here i hate that fucking shit there but i promise you i'm gonna get this shit off honey i promise you i'm gonna get it off honey I'm going to get it off. So thank you for joining my channel, my friends. I miss you guys. And thank you for coming back. I will definitely talk to you, my friends, later. Bye.